that's me reading. That's what my comfort zone was since my dad took me and my sister to the library every Saturday. But what I didn't know was uh, I could have been doing other things such as hustling, like selling chocolate bars during lunch in the elementary school and mowing lawns in the neighborhood, or even waking up at 4.30 a.m. to deliver newspapers. I would have learned the business fundamentals that I'm beginning to learn right now. Oh my god, shut up. You're so boring. Another thing I could have known was not to worry and not to try and be perfect. Later I read that worrying is caused by not accepting uncertainty in the forms of cognitive distortions. That's it, I can't listen to this anymore. I'm gonna kill you. Alright, here are some examples of cognitive distortions that cause worrying. Overgeneralization. Generalizing from a single negative experience, expecting it to be true forever. If I didn't get hired for the job, I'll never get any job. Mental filter. Focusing on the negatives while filtering out the positives. Noticing the one thing that went wrong rather than all the things that went right. Wait, what's that flapping sound? Okay, I don't know what just happened there. So back to what I was talking about. Another thing you should know is that your greatest strength is also your greatest weakness. Take uh, being competitive, for example. In sports, being competitive is good because uh, it drives you to play better. But being competitive with friends or trying to force your friends to do things may cause problems in relationships. Or if you're the type of person to think things Thoroughly, you might think of all the possibilities and make moves that are efficient, but overthinking will also make you hesitate or take action when it's too late. You must never hesitate. <laughs> and lastly, you should know that whatever you want to do, you just got to figure it out. Whether it's you want to go to space, or you want to play in the NBA, or make a future film. Wait a minute, who is this guy? Okay, here's a good example. Now I got to figure out how to kill this dragon. So yeah, you can uh, figure things out by coming up with a game plan and trying it out. If it doesn't work, you just come up with another one, try that out too until you reach your goal, whatever it is.